what's going on so uh, I'm a little sick if you couldn't tell I'm gonna try my best to do uh, commentary or what have you but if it just if it doesn't work out then I'll just make this commentary list I don't know. See where we were at. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> all right. Okay, I've planted charges all around the perimeter of the camp. You <coughs> just need to arm them. Mm -hmm. First one should be right ahead of you. There. Here it is. I also left the detonator for you. Uh huh. There we are. All right. First one set. Don't touch the button. This one? <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> Once you've set all the charges, just hit the detonator and it's showtime. Just be careful. Zarovich has got his men posted all around the perimeter. Keep an eye out for patrols. <sighs> I'm sweating like a hooker in church. You brought a hooker to church? Why not? Thought they would have see, seen me, saw me. Haven't been dry for a month. One well, metal's gotta be here, you complaining like that. He just knocked over the light post. Why would you do that? <laughs> Got him. Oh shoot, how do I get up there? Yeah, got him. Intruder! God damn it. Oh. 
thought I had him too. Where the hell did those guys come from anyway? I can't mash. <laughs> Shit. This way. Nate, you should be approaching excavation site one by now. So happy I didn't actually fall. There's someone here! Oh. Take them out, fast. We can't let them send word back to camp. Not as good with my headshots this game. Being sick kind of makes me more focused. Hold on. Dude, I'm a beast with it. Why? Hold up. It hasn't done that in a while. I don't know why it did that. You should be getting close to the first camp. I planted four more charges in there, but you're going to have to clear the place out before you can arm them. Why is this here? A little cl too close to my screen, TBH. Here's the camp. You ready for this? Let's do it. Oh, Jesus Christ, that scared me. This is my hiding spot. Get away. Finding it a little hard to breathe too, so we still gotta arm three of the I gotta try and keep myself calm. There should be only two left. Thanks, Sullivan. Excuse me. Alright, one more, and we're out of here. Are you, are you gonna help find him? Around. Chill out. All the yet. God damn. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's all of them. Now let's go past <laughs> the Lazar. With pleasure. Can't reach us. Come on over here. I'll give you a boost. Come on, gorgeous, jump up. Yep. Uh, well, 
You got a great ass, Sully. Uh, thanks. There you go, kid. Uh, all right. Ooh, that must have been some tsunami to watch these ships so far inland. No treasure up here? Seriously? all about my treasures, you know. Alright, I'm uh, Hold on, hold on. Okay. Get down. Shit, the pop is down again. Uh, the damn thing is always breaking down. Come on, let's just fix it so we can get out of here. Look, they're not armed. Not that we what we're waiting for. We can take these guys. I don't know, Sully. Maybe... Uh! Oh! Play nice. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Could have used some help down here. Yeah, you were doing fine. Yeah. Oh, there's another one for you. Something. Ah. Enough of this frivolity, kid. Come on, we got work to do. What does frivolity mean? What do you bet we follow the hose? We find the camp. You always follow the hose, just like in Montreal, huh? You're never gonna forget that, are you? We could have just gone around. <laughs> Oh, that's where the guy came from. There's no treasure, though. I lost... Both my guns down there? Are you serious? Chapter 4, the day. The dig. I think I see the camp up ahead. Are you ready? Wait, wait, just hold on a sec. Three months and you have found nothing. Well, well, well now wait, wait a minute. We've been commander. Be Lazarevich. This man was caught stealing artifacts from site number five. <laughs> you would betray me for this? No, no, Zoran, I can't explain. No, no need, no need. <laughs> What do you say we really ruin this guy's day? I like that line a lot. Do it. Run out! Search the perimeter! Go! Alright. Let's get it going. Alright, it's all yours, kid. I'll cover you from here. Are you okay? Oh. 
Thank you, Sullivan. Man, this Lazarevich guy isn't screwing around, Sully. You should see all this stuff. He's got files on every expedition to find Shambhala. All the way back to the 1600s. What about Marco Polo's journals? <laughs> Here they are. Just hurry it up. You haven't got much time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The worthy pilgrim is granted a golden passport to conquer obstacles on his journey to Shambhala. Huh. Is that supposed to mean something? Beats me. Hold on. Here we go. It was with great sorrow that I left my fellow travelers to their fate. A fate decreed by the dreadful cargo we bore from Shambhala. They must have thought that tsunami was some kind of divine retribution. Wait a minute. Damn. Sully, I don't think the Chintamani Stone is here. What? Listen to this. I, I would have sooner endured the wrath of Kublai Khan himself than remove the Chintamani Stone from that sacred shrine. Marco Polo never had the stone. Then what dreadful cargo was he talking about? I don't know. Well, if the stone's not here, what the hell is Lazarovich looking for? Shambhala. Here in Borneo? He's a little wide of the mark, don't you think? He must be trying to pick up Marco Polo's trail. Back to Shambhala. Why? <laughs> because the stone is still there. <sighs> Chloe, can you talk? Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. In all this digging they've done, have they found any bodies, any remains at all? No, now that you mention it, nothing. Why? <laughs> Over 600 people were shipwrecked here, yet there's no bodies. Don't you find that a little odd? So where did they all go? Where would you go if a tsunami hit? To higher ground. Bingo. We head to that mountain. What do you bet we find Marco's pals? Chloe, can you meet up with us? Already on my way. Great. Uh-oh. Nate, you gotta get out of there. You're gonna have to give me a minute, Sully. You don't have a minute. What's this? They're all dead. Oh, crap. Spread out. Stay down, kid. I got you covered. Oh, body over here. You well, that's convenient. <laughs> I'm be switching fingers. Hold up. Oof. Watch out! Take cover. What did you just say? Oh, bless up. Thank you, Sully. Where? Like I flanked them. Hold up. That was pretty spicy what I just did right there. It's a spicy moment. Closing in on me. 
Here. Serious? I got more than I can handle here. What are you talking about? Black suit guys do not die. Here. Uh -oh. Shit. Okay. There we go. That's what I was looking for. How? Shit, oh, how convenient. God damn it. Just Actually, give me the moss. Give me that moss. Should be this way. Sup, fatter? Got them treasures, you know what I'm just saying? Discreet places, that's all I'm Whoa, saying. Sully. Look at these stones. Ah, now we're getting somewhere. Now we're getting somewhere. Give me the treasure. Okay. <laughs> Would you look at that? Oh yeah. Hey. Hello. Hey yourself. What do we have here? With any luck, the last resting place of Marco Polo's crew. Shall we check it out? Okay. <laughs> so uh, why else are we here? Thousands of years old. At least. Can I get a light, please? Down this way. Wow. Looks like we hit the jackpot. Ooh, there must be hundreds of bodies down here. Look at their teeth. They're all black. I think they're all that way. They must have taken refuge here during the tsunami. There's got to be some sort of clue around here. Hmm? <laughs> <sighs> Whoops. Uh... God. Hey, I think I found something. In here. What? I'm, I'm not they scared. They carried their cargo all the way up here after they were shipwrecked. Hello. More resin? More resin? I've seen this before. Me too. Sully, give me a light. Oh, look at their eyes, bro. Wait a minute. This is blood. It's everywhere. Looks like a real massacre. All right, let's follow the blood stains. We'll see if they lead somewhere. Jesus.
Did I lose it? Hold up. Don't do that. Seems to end at this wall. Yeah, that's odd. I, I knew we were supposed to go this way. This moves a little. Sully, help me out. Just to know it was supposed to be now. I think I hurt myself. I think you're just old. You know who I kind of sound like with my voice like this? The trail I'm sick. leads in here. Oh, More bodies. I kind of sound like uh, Captain Spirit. Sound like uh, Chris. It's me, Captain Spirit. You know, maybe I'm crazy. <laughs> okay, that hurts. I'm not gonna but do it. Looks anymore. like they all killed each other. Come on, Nate. You're just getting spooked. Damn. This dude has a uh, little mace in his head. You're trying to tell me I'm nuts. Where's the treasure at? You already know there's one in here. If there's not, I'm gonna be surprised. Okay. <sighs> this what do we have here careful <laughs> mighty <laughs> just kidding Nate you're gonna give me a goddamn heart attack oh man is that an ugly friggin thing what is it? Some kind of weapon? Mm. No, no, it's a, a purba. It's a ritual object from Tibet. It's used to destroy obstacles. Huh? No, you know, spiritual ones. Oh. Wait a minute. Hmm. Wait, could this be what Marco Polo was talking about? Kid, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> Thank you. In his journal, he wrote that uh, the worthy seeker would be given a golden passport to conquer obstacles on the journey to Shambhala. So, what, this is it? Look, that's all really interesting, but where the hell is it a passport to? Well, maybe this map would help. Let me see that. <laughs> Between Greater India and the province of Tibet lies a field of exquisitely finished temples, hundreds of gilded spires stretching as far as the eye can see. Hold on, I know this place. It's in Nepal. Yeah, except it's not just a field of temples anymore, it's a city. Well, that could make things a little more challenging. Now, hold on, there's more. In all these many temples, only one conceals the secret path to Shambhala. Shambhala. And that path shall only be revealed to the pilgrim who bears the golden passport. All <laughs> right, nice work, kid. So what are we waiting for? Let's get out of here. All right. See ya. So your hairline is a mess, buddy. That's all I'm saying. Let's get going. Okay. Treasures? <laughs> I'm obsessed with these treasures, dude. Where are they? Alright, well, Chloe's impatient. Wants to go, so... We'll do what the lady says. <laughs> I'm gonna go out and make sure the coast is clear. I'll see you in a bit. I guess we don't get the all clear. Damn. Can you give me a hand, Nate? I'm sick, dude. I'm not myself. You already know what I was looking at. Get your hands up. You sure know how to pick them. Shut up, sorry. Should have known it was you. <laughs> and you. Victor, goddamn Sullivan. You still dragging this tired old sack of shit around? Easy, Nate. Hmm. That's pretty ballsy for a guy who spent the last three months behind bars. Better than pissing away three months in the jungle without a clue. Found the ships, though, didn't I? You couldn't find your own ass with both hands. And a map. <laughs> They came from down there. Whoa. 
Harry, look at this. Speaking of maps... Between India and Tibet, one temple will reveal a pathway oh. to Shambhala. Jesus, Flynn, while we're young. Oh, no. Don't be such a bad sport. Take them to Lazarevich. You're gonna wish you'd stayed in prison, mate. Move. Jesus. Come on, keep moving. It's like a 15 foot drop, my guy. <laughs> Are you alright? Yeah, well, it'll make it look more believable. Now I'm gonna try and buy you some time. No, Chloe, you have to come with us. No. Just meet me in Nepal. Now run. Jesus. Alright. Let's go. I like her. Yeah, I bet you do. You were here talking about, you know, you sure know how to pick them. Run for it! Chill out. Jump! Oh, hold on there, son bitch. You gotta be out of your mind. We'll break our goddamn necks. Now, if we get caught, Lazarevich will break them for us. I'm getting too old for this bullshit. <laughs> Come on, now don't you start this again. <coughs> Listen, I don't have your luck. Guys like me gotta know when to walk away from the table. Sully, we're gonna get out of this, okay? We always do. Yeah. You go meet your girl in Nepal. I'm going somewhere warm. Come on. Hey, you can tell me all about it when you get back. Shit. Well, shall we? After you, Butch. See you in hell, kid. <laughs> Shit. Well, when you said Lazarevich had a head start on us, you weren't kidding. Well, he's had some help from the local guerrillas. The city's been on the brink of civil war for years. He just needed to throw a little gasoline on the fire. Charming. Yeah, well, all the chaos provides some cover while he destroys the city looking for the right temple. Nate? Hello? Yeah, I'm still here. You're not having second thoughts, are you? No, oh, me? Never. Good, because I'm so ready to be done with these clowns. You got a map? Uh... Yeah. I'll meet you in the old market. Things are pretty quiet over there. All right, you got it. Uh oh. I got company. Oh, great. Can you lose them? I think it might be too late for that. Come on. Nate, are you all right? I've been better. <laughs> I remember, I think this was uh, part of the demo they showed at the E3. Leave me alone. Holy shit. shit. That's what I'm saying, bro. Good one. Well, I think we'll stop the video there. <laughs> it's a good place to stop. We're gonna continue doing the Uncharted series. We're gonna finish up Just Cause 4 and then pick another game to play. Life is Strange 2 Episode 2 comes out soon. I'm gonna play that. I'm excited for that. And... That's about it. Those are the plans for the channel.
If you liked the video, please consider subscribing. If you watched the whole video, please consider leaving a like, dislike, and a comment, share the video, whatever you want, you know? And thank you for watching.